Guardian Home Inspection, Performing Sewer Line Inspection for 15623 Van Ness Avenue, Gardena, California, 90249. Square footage 1628, three bedroom, three bath, built in 1943. The property faces east, but the sewer goes to the rear alley to the west. I'm at a clean out located at the rear of the property. The clean out's a three inch ABS. Um, here's the property. And so I'll be sticking this camera in to see what we see in this main sewer line. I have the bathroom water turned on. See that, that's that water. So I'm gonna to try to get as far as I can and then come back dry. So the sewer line is ABS. It's typical for newer newer sewer lines to have ABS. So I don't wanna see any uh, standing water. Here, right here, we see a little offset with uh, clay. Hear that, see that? So that's where the clay starts. Let me try to get past that. There you go, I'm past that. So now that's clay. So that was a little joint offset. So once I'm, I get to the main city sewer saddle connection, I'll turn the water off and then I'll come back dry just to see that again. Uh, a couple of joint offsets, Not, nothing too exciting there. Um, I see a little bit of, uh, it looks like uh, a little bit of broken pipe there, but it's still intact. So I'm just gonna note this. So this is clay here. The clay pipe is a good sewer line pipe, but sometimes it does get damaged. The sewer line or the clay joints are made with concrete and they occasionally get damaged. They don't last as long as the clay pipe does. So this sewer line doesn't extend that far. I'm 38 feet out. That bottom number there, 38, point, 38 feet 1 inch. And then the other number is the slope of the camera. So here, when it starts to dip down, that's telling me it's getting close to the main city saddle connection. A little gushing water, sorry about that. And then the turn indicates the main city saddle here. So let's go. So that's the main city right here. So I'm gonna go turn off the water and then uh, be right back. Okay, I'm all done with the inspection here. I flushed the toilet, and that's the flush toilet here. I will see a gush of water, there it is. So, now I'm gonna come back dry. That's the flush toilet, and that's the city connection there, the city saddle. That's underneath the alley, the rear alley here. And it looks good, I don't see any issues, damaged pipe, cracked pipe. That's the city drain, the city sewage there. So. Good news, you know, I don't see any major issues. Um, usually, uh, it doesn't take too much to visualize these damages, cracked pipe or uh, sewer that is blocked or obstructed because you would see it. See, so I'm getting a good picture here. So now I'm just gonna retract my camera and come back dry. I turned off all the water fixtures. And then right here, you know, you see, you see some cracking. See, this, there, there's some cracking there, some clay pipe cracking. Um, that, that could be leaking, but it would be leaking into the soil there. Uh, so see, I'll note that. Um, the only thing you could do is pretty pretty much install a liner if you wanted to there on that, that slope there. Uh, I think it would be a long run for a short slide because it's a minimal crack. It's there, it's present. So I'm, you know, I'm just disclosing these issues. Um, some of the issues uh, will be recommended to repair, but that's a little tough. You know, it's up to you if you wanted to pursue that uh, for that small crack. And I think we, we saw more cracking, you know, different areas, like right there. Um, and like I said, that's typical for sewer line. Um, I don't see any obstructions or tree root intrusions. So now we're just retracting my camera. Another like small crack, see that up there? 
And then this could have been, these cracks could have been formed when the main sewer line was installed, you know, back original in 1948 or whatever it was, sorry. And then, uh, all right, so now just retracting. So it looks good, except for that, that uh, and then that few cracks, and then the joint offset that we're going to see in a second here uh, from the connection to the to the right there. See that? It's kind of big. So that is located 13 feet out. See that? And then like toilet paper can just go boop, stop right there. And then look, I'm underwater. So that's uh, that's troublesome because um, it could cause backup. Uh, see that? Uh, it looks like the ABS closest to us, proximal to that clay pipe, is sagging, and you have uh, a big joint offset with standing water there. See that? So now, like, you get toilet paper and crud, and it's just gonna go boop, stop right there, and then you know it could create, could create a backup. So what I'll do is I'll put my camera right at that location, and then I'll locate that spot my camera has a sawn, it emits a radio frequency, I can locate that and it'll tell me how deep I am as well. So let me go do that, I'll be right back. Okay, so I located that joint offset. The good news, it's uh, three feet deep and uh, you know, it shouldn't be that big of a deal to repair. Uh, I do recommend repairing because it's look it's creating a dam effect you know you're gonna get blockage there so it's recommended it's located right near that main sewer line uh, at the rear and I took a picture it'll be in the report and it's only three feet deep so I do recommend having that repaired so other than that I mean it looks pretty decent uh, the sewer line heads out to the alley which look good uh, so and that's it so I'm all done with the inspection here um, and then what I'll do is thank you for using Guardian Home Inspection, you know, you're watching this on YouTube, so this is the uh, property. So uh, give me a call if you have any questions. Thanks again.